Uh, I swear we've done this before. This is all so familiar. Okay, now he's convinced himself he actually is Weasel. Joe, you need to go back to whatever nursing home or insane asylum you escaped from. Maybe there's some truth to what Joe's saying. Maybe we're all trapped in an endless cycle. You guys really don't believe me? Barack, my president, please, you have to remember. I'm sorry, Joe. I, I think I finally agree with Donald. You have lost it. We need to break this cycle before we all forget again. I'm not crazy. Soon enough, you will all see the truth. My name is Stanley Ferguson. I was a Secret Service agent for every president, starting with George W. Bush and up to Joseph Biden. Today, we will be recounting the strange but true story of how four U.S. presidents vanished off the face of the earth. Joe, I I'm speechless. We're so sorry we didn't believe you. I can't believe this is really happening. Then you all must repent. Repent for your crimes during your time as president so we can finish this Easter egg. Are you kidding me? You heard the cassette tape. This is your fault. Your dumbass couldn't carry your weight in the easiest Easter egg ever made. No, Donald, you must atone for your crimes. You're gonna keep us trapped here. No, Donald, what have you done? I just won, stupid Joe. GG, better luck next time. Ah! Ah! Damn it. Why are those fools getting so popular on YouTube? Am I not qualified enough to be a presidential zomboy? My lord, you promised me my retribution. Why are you not helping me? Have I not been a faithful servant? You must not exist. What a fool I've been. Doubt no longer, President Clinton. I am here. Our revenge will soon be at hand. My, my lord, is that you? Yes, President, it is I. Your faithfulness over the years has not gone unnoticed. I'm so sorry for doubting your existence, my lord. Uh, I had a moment of weakness, of, um, but I am still your humble servant. I have been so overwhelmed lately. It is understandable, Mr. President. You are but a lowly base creature who wishes only to save his own skin. It's just all my hard work to grow my YouTube channel, and I'm stuck at 100 subs. Then those four get together and become huge. It's not fair. I care not about your pathetic YouTube channel. Luckily for you, our goals align, and you have been a good little pawn for the Apothecons, those wretched four. George Bush, Barack Obama, Donald Trump, Joseph Biden. Their sins will be their undoing. Y yes of course. My life is nothing more than a means to an end to help you achieve your goal, my master. Did you know, Bill, that there are an infinite number of realities? In all of them, those four presidents achieve what you could not. Joseph Biden is the key. The presidential zomboy success hinges on him more than any other. In this reality that we preside in, your death will be the catalyst to lure the presidential zomboys of the prime dimension. If we stop that universe's presidents, the Apothecon's plans will go unimpeded. Yes, of course, my lord. But I must admit I'm afraid. Though as wicked as my flesh in this life may be, I must admit I have grown accustomed to it. And my beloved Hillary. You mortals and your material attachments, it can't be helped, of course. I promise this, my friend, in our new reality that we will be crafting, your wife, as awful as she is, would be the 45th president. Thank you, my lord. Thank you. I am unworthy of such a gift. Um, may I ask, how do we set this trap for Biden? As we all know, Biden is a noob at cod zombies. You have access to him as a former president yourself. Convince them to play mob of the dead. The rivalry between Joe and Donald will trap them. This will create a dimension that will lure the Earth Prime presidential zomboys to do the blood of the dead Easter egg. Then you, in your new form, will ensure their demise. I will do as you instruct me to my lord. I do wonder how my new form will be. I have ordered an electric chair to my residence, as the Illuminati told me to. I know what I must do. Hillary was very concerned, but my sacrifice will ensure our perfect future. Fear not, Bill. 
The pain will be worth it in the end. Your service to the Overlords is appreciated. Damn it, what is it? I told you no interruptions. Uh, Mr. President, it's your Secret Service agent. I heard you talking. Are you okay? Yes, now leave me be. Wait, listen to him, William. It's just, the presidential zomboys are live-streaming themselves doing the mob of the dead Easter egg. Thought you might want to support your buddies. Oh, perfect. My work here is done. Time to finally transcend to a new dimension and leave this hell behind. Uh, Mr. President? Haha, <laughs> I'm gonna burn. Wet the sponge and place it on your head, President Clinton. Then flip the switch. Your new paradise awaits. Goodbye, my Hillary. Ah! President Clinton, you okay in there? I'm gonna kick the door down. What the? There's nobody here. Oh boy, I think I'm in trouble. Okay, whose bright idea was it to play Blood of the Dead? I hate this dog shit of a map. That would be Joe. I just felt like we had to do this Easter egg. Like a calling. I don't know if we'll be able to do this one with you, Joe. This shit is mind-numbingly hard. We have to. This one has been on my mind for a long time. I find that hard to believe, Joe, because you never have anything on your mind for longer than two minutes, Max. Well, I'm almost afraid to ask, but Joe, are you running better perks than you were the last time we played B04? I sure am. I'm running Deadshot, Mule Kick, Blaze Phase, and for my modifier, Death Perception. Bruh, those are the worst perks in the game. Welp, we'll be reviving Joe a hell of a lot, that's for sure. Good thing I brought a perkaholic with me. Maybe we should have invited Bill instead. To be honest, I haven't even heard from Bill in a hot minute. Hope he's doing okay. Last I heard, he started his own zombies channel on YouTube. But ever since I beat his bitch wife, Killary, in the 2016 election, he hasn't talked to me. I mean, can you blame him? I'm sure if she had become POTUS, he could have been able to get away from her for a little while. It's a busy job. Well, like Joe said, he's been MIA lately. Not that I care, of course. Fuck the Clintons. Just took out the warden, grabbing the key for the shield. Good shit, George. I'm working on feeding the first dog head in the new industries building. What an adorable little hellhound. Hey, everyone, get to a box location. Joe, pop temporal gift. I'm going to spawn in a fire sale. I have a shit ton of these elixirs. Let's try and get some good weapons. I'm at one. Almost at one. Go ahead and pop it. Let's fucking go. Got the Mark II. And the Blundergat right after? My box luck is insane. Doesn't look like I'm going to get anything good from this fire sale. Me either, to be honest. Don't worry, gents. I got plenty more immolation liquidations where that came from. We will all get the Blundergat before attempting this egg. Giving these dogs the good suck so I can summon Pap on the roof. Now, why in God's green earth did you have to word it like that? Yeah, kind of sus, George, not going to lie. Regardless, whose bright idea was it over at Treyarch to have a moving pack-a-punch on this map and with no way to tell where it is without running across the entire map to check? Even shitty Voyage of Despair knew to do that much. I don't know Donald, but they should be sentenced to life at Alcatraz. Just finished the first wolf head. Look at you, Joe, actually doing something useful. Good job. Also, I think I already know the answer, but who the hell is running Quacknarok? Me, of course. Those zombies look so cute in those little duck floaties. First of all, Joe, you're a weirdo. Secondly, goddamn George, I'm lagging my ass off. Fix your shitter net. I think that's on your end, Donald. I don't hear anyone else complaining. Anyways, grab the Hell's Retriever, gonna go get the spoon. Does someone have monkey bombs so we can get Brutus to open the wall in the warden's house? Uh, yeah, I do. Entering the code, gonna go grab the spoon. I'm gonna start the upgrade quest for the Magma Gat. I'm gonna buy my soda! Perk. Why the hell did you scream it like that, Joe? My damn ears. I miss when we had a president who was in his right mind, namely me. You know what I miss? The Golden Gate Bridge. One of the most iconic parts of Mob of the Dead, and they removed it. Yeah, whoever made that decision was smoking more wacky tobacco than me during my state senate days. Shit, I went down trying to summon a Brutus. Someone pick me up. I got you, George. Man, I'm sure glad I'm running death perception. No zombie is gonna sneak up on me. You could learn a thing or two from me, George. Damn, Joe called your ass out. Also, I'm knifing the wall in the warden's house. Getting the magma gat? I'll bring the warden that spawns to the wall so we can open the secret room. All right, there we go. Now we gotta go put the red orb on the map and spawn and then start the dreaded bird step. Yeah, this step sucks. Joe, think you can help us look for this bird? 
Joe, wake the hell up, man. You need to lay off the Lunesta. Sorry. Just the thought of having to search 40 plus fucking spawns for that bird put me to sleep. Well, you gotta pull your weight, Joe. We're not gonna do every step without you doing a goddamn thing. The bird has spawned in. Start looking, people. Found the first bird, guys. We can end the round. Good shit, Barry. All right, it's a dog round. Joe, keep one alive since you're not helping us while we look for the bird. Come on, man. Why can't you guys appreciate what I have to offer? I know I can help if you just let me. Joe, stop mumbling and just train a dog around, please. Even you, Obama, I just want to be respected. Heads up, Joe, got a couple dogs for you to take off my back. Great Caesar's ghost, Donald. That's more than just a couple. Well, to be fair, I don't think Donald ever learned how to count higher than three. You're right, George. Hey, found the second bird, end the round. Fuck both of you. Anyways, I found the next bird. So for this last bird, we gotta listen for a crying man. That'll tell us where the bird is because you can't see it like the last three. Then type in 872 on the number pad to summon a zombie blood. Then whoever is in zombie blood mode needs to throw their hell's retriever at the bird. That sounds kind of confusing. Can you say that again? Joe, explaining it again would be a colossal waste of time. I found out where the bird is anyways. I'm in zombie blood mode, gonna go get the chronorium. Got it. Now onto the challenges. Looks like it might be the banjo challenge. We should be able to do this easily. I mean, I'm sure George's Texan hillbilly ass knows how to play a banjo. Oh, shut up, Donald. Everyone just stay in the circle and get kills. The circle has moved. Let's hustle, boys. Oh, really, Joe? I was thinking we could just stand around and do nothing. Damn, Obama. Can't believe I'm saying this, but no need to be a dick about it. Stop with the petty squabbling, guys. We need to focus for this Easter egg. Just keep killing these freak bags. Okay, banjo step is done. Me and George here are getting the red orb that dropped. The numbers are 886. Entered the code, look for the next portal. Found it, it's the Michigan Avenue challenge, AKA the really fun escort step. Since when are escort missions fun, Donnie? Since right now, probably the best step of this godforsaken egg, or it would be if I wasn't lagging my ass off. Donald, how can you be a billionaire and not have that Google Fiber internet? I have the best internet, believe me, it's amazing, simply incredible. Your internet is the problem, George. Let's just focus on getting this wayward spirit to his final destination. This ghost is just like me, he just wanted a snack from the cafeteria. Do you think they might have some chocolate chocolate chip in there? Uh, I doubt it. Hey, everyone, pull out your specialist weapons. Shit's about to get as hectic as all get out. Roasting these zombie bastards like how I roast my enemies on Twitter. Almost there, boys. Keep destroying these freak bags. Sliced and diced. Stop with the cheesy one-liners, George. Let's move on to the next challenge. What, what the hell? Who the fuck turned on that trap? You got me killed. My bad, Joe. Totally didn't see you there. Anyways, grab the orb. I'll go check the chronorium for the numbers. The number is 369. All right, Agent Orange, entering the code. Now get to looking for the portal, guys. Got to pat my AN-94 first. I'm so glad they brought back this legend from Black Ops 2. Found it. It's the powerhouse challenge. Someone needs to meet me at Building 64 and help me with the Simon Says step. Oh, can I help, Donald? I'm tired of always being the guy who has to train the zombie around. You really think I trust your demented ass to handle something as simple as Simon Says Joe? No way! Me and Obama got this. I just wanted to help out. Shut up, Joe, we're trying to focus here. There we go, Donald. If you have a pen and paper handy, take note of the symbols that we have to remember. Also, grab the punch card. God, I fucking hate this step. It takes way too long and isn't fun in the slightest. I know, we're almost done with it though, thank God. Don't you mean thank Allah since you're a Muslim foreigner? First of all, Donald, fuck you with your racist birther nonsense. Secondly, Allah and God mean the same thing. Whatever, that step is done with, thanks to yours truly and his IQ of 4,329,211,402. What a load of malarkey. Is that why you speak at a third grade level, tweet like you rode the short bus to school, and have the haircut of someone who had to wear a safety helmet every day? Holy shit, he annihilated your ass, Donald. Worse than when I annihilated the Middle East stability. Fuck you, sleepy creepy Joe. At least I don't sniff on little girls. But 
whatever, I'm going to go piss. Obama, protect me. Hold on a minute. My bedroom door is locked from the outside, and my windows are completely blocked off. I can't see anything or leave. Hold up. Now that you mention it, the same thing is happening here, and my Secret Service agents are nowhere to be found. What's going on? That's so weird. I had the feeling like we had to do this Easter egg like we're being forced to by something or someone. I am freaking the fuck out, man. But I don't see any alternatives than what Joe said. We got to beat blood of the dead. Well, the next challenge is the one where we got to kill the ghost with the trap in the new industries building. How does killing a ghost make sense? Well, it doesn't, George. But I've got the ghost trapped in this doorway. You guys suck him with your shield key. Make sure we have plenty of shield blasts as well. Well, your little ghost buddy slipped past your fat ass somehow, Donald. Just keep sucking him as he makes his way to the trap. Can you guys please stop talking about sucking everything? First, George wants to suck hellhounds. Now, Barack wants to suck ghosts. For once, I agree with you, Joe. Stop being sus, you two. OK, OK, grabbing the next orb, all that's left is the Doc's challenge, which means, ugh, fucking Morse code. Don't worry, I got this. Just protect me, someone. You know, I bet Joe's brain sounds a lot like Morse code, just a bunch of beep and boop sounds. You're so cruel, Donald. What did I ever do to you? Uh, you stole the presidency from me, that's what. You should be lucky I'm even kind enough to carry you through Easter eggs. Let's make our way to the infirmary. We just got to escort a ghost to a boat on the docks. Guys, we are in a scary situation right now. We should be banding together, not arguing. George is right. Here's the ghost. Let's get him to the docks pronto. All right, stupid ghost, get your ass on the gondola. What the hell? He teleported off. He must have heard you call him stupid, Don. Let's ride the gondola back up. Damn, he ran far away from the gondola. Must have gotten a whiff of your breath, Donald. Shut it, Joe. We almost got him to the docks. After that, we can start the boss fight. I dead ass never even noticed that there was a ghost boat in the water. But we got the orb. Now let's head to the warden's house. Make sure we all got papped weapons and perks. Your eternal punishment will soon begin. They will soon be released from their prison as you four enter yours. Hold up, that wasn't for my headset. That was real life. Thank you, old friend. You have allowed my plan to be set into motion. Now you belong to me. Ah! Ugh, my head. Barack, is that you? This isn't a game anymore. We're actually in Alcatraz. Stay calm. Barry, why did he call you his old friend? I don't know. Trust me, I don't know anyone that looks like the warden from COD Zombies. I, I feel like he's after me. Like I'm the reason this is happening. Sleepy, if you know something, then tell us. Well, it's more of a feeling than anything. Wait, do you guys hear that? Oh, this guy again. What the fuck do you want? You think that this is your prison? That you can repay your debts to existence? What you did to me? Uh, buddy, we don't even know you. Oh, but you did. In my former life. Perhaps this will help you remember. I did not have sexual relations with that woman. Bill? Bill Clinton? What the hell happened to you, man? Your marriage to Crooked Hillary really took a toll on your face. She should be the one locked up here. Silence! This is my life sentence. The reason I was born. The reason I have suffered and bled. While you four prospered on YouTube, I worked hard for nothing. Now you four are trapped with me. This is my Armageddon. Huh. Some Armageddon William. I don't know who you think you are, but I served in the Air National Guard. I'll kick your ass like how I did your VP in 2000. Quiet, George! We all know the Supreme Court rigged that election. Regardless, do you not hear it? Beating deep in your veins. Biden, your blood is the key to releasing them onto our world. The Apothecons. Soon my master will be free. Uh, Apothecons, have you lost it? Those aren't real Bill, they're from a video game. You can see as clearly as anyone, Barack. This is no game. Now rest yourselves. Soon we will begin. Lights out! This can't be happening. We lost. This is the end of the presidential Zomboys. I don't like admitting defeat, but this does seem rather bleak. 
What will happen to our families and friends if the Apothecons are released? I just want to go home to my Laura. Oh shit, Hal Arlington, the bird, he's freed us. Thank you, Weasel. Grab your guns, guys. We got to do a real life boss fight. Joe, you better focus up. You can't be holding us back. I got the acid gat for Aunt Jemima's sake. Why the acid gat and not the magma gat, you noob? Get back in your cells! Not a chance, Bill. Have fight us like a man, or are you gonna make your wife do it for you? Follow Arlington, everyone. We're almost at the lab. Not so fast. Now to see my full power. You are one ugly son of a bitch. You look like a fucking super mutant from Fallout. Look, the spirits of Alcatraz are buying us time. I will not be disobeyed. Let me go this instant! Oop, see ya, Bill. Let's go, boys. Oh, the cryopod. Who's that in there? I can't tell. I don't know. Probably not important, though. Let's just go destroy this former president. This is it, guys. Our toughest battle. We're not gonna let creepy Bill Clinton beat the presidential zomboys. You fools will suffer here for all eternity. You will pay for not letting me be part of your YouTube channel. He really sold his soul to the Apothecons because we had more subs than him. Kind of cringe if you ask me. Bill, you've always been a sad, scared, jealous little man. Even Donald is somehow a better friend and POTUS than you ever were. That was definitely a backhanded compliment. But thanks, Joe. Orbs are destroyed. Shield blast above the dark mechanism. I think we gotta do that one more time. Then only one way this will end. This will only end with your blood powering my machine, opening the gateway. Bill, do you realize how stupid you sound? Your wife thought she had a 100% chance of beating me, and I defied all odds. The same thing will happen to you. Donald, you will suffer 1,000 fold for insulting my beloved Hillary. This is so intense. We can't die here, fellas. We've got this. This is the end for you. I'm tossing a nuke, not unlike what I did in the Middle East. Destroy the orbs! Shield blasting you! Okay, now what do we do? Time for old Sleepy Joe to do something useful during an Easter egg. Stand back, gentlemen. Bill, you want my blood? Take my blood! Ah! What are you doing? Joe, get out of there. Don't tell me another Joe is gonna come out of the fifth cryopod. Ah, there we go, just as planned. Time to go save those three. Guys, look at the door that we came through. It is another Joe. Seriously, how the fuck is that possible? Take this, Bill. Biden, blast! What? Impossible! I just wanted to be a presidential zomboy. Goodbye, Hillary. Damn, Joe, you tore his flesh asunder with that attack. We did it. Time to go home now, right? That's right, Barack. The cycle has been broken, and the Apothecons will not harm this or any other reality, thanks to your efforts. Let's fucking go! All right, that must be the portal home, boys. Let's go. Drone strikes, uh, I mean ice cream are on me when we get back. Donald, what are you waiting for? Your friends have left. No, one of them hasn't. <coughs> Donald, is that you? I was so scared I was gonna be left to die here alone. Never, Joe. I'm sorry Barack and George left. You literally saved our lives, thank you. Don't <coughs> mention it, Donald. Joe, I, I'm sorry for all the times I was rude to you, the bullying, all of it. Truth be told, I was jealous of you. When you beat me in 2020, I was vengeful. But I always thought you were a cool dude. Yeah, you finally admit I beat you fair and square. Don't get used to it. You should save your breath though, buddy. You must be in a lot of pain, I'm sorry. I'm dying anyways. No point saving it, Donnie. Well, uh, let me enjoy a last laugh with my friend. The other you told us that the cycle is broken. In this and every other dimension, your sacrifice saved the entire multiverse, literally countless lives. You're a damn hero. <laughs> that means the world coming from the Donald. Who would have thought? Sleepy Joe, a hero. I see a light trump. I, I'm scared. It'll be okay, Joe. I believe you'll be rewarded well in heaven, and I guess the country will still be in your culpable hands with this second, Joe. Just know the impact of your life and the sacrifice you made today saved literally every life in every reality. You should be proud. 
Thank you, Donald. And please tell Hunter I love him and to lay off the drugs for his old man. I will, Joe. I will. Donald, the portal is about to close. We gotta go now. Damn it, I'm not ready to leave my friend. Go, Don, you don't want to be trapped here with me. Thank you for staying with me as long as you could. Goodbye, my friend. Goodbye, Joe. I love your brother. I wanted to keep going, this me. I was the nicest one, and you won't even remember. <laughs>